Why are you, you? It's not an accident. There's a plan, a blueprint, an instruction manual, a no return policy, and a very shaky warranty. We've all got one. It's called the genome. The complete set of your DNA, volumes A through Z. The code of you. Four letters, GCTA, arranged in billions and billions of combinations unique to you and your twin or clone. Well, some of it is unique. Okay, 0.1% is unique to you. It's still very cool. The study of all this info, that's genomics. First step for every mad scientist. It's how we make you better, stronger, faster. Okay, maybe not quite, but it is how we change the world. Genomics has gone all the way from the discovery of genes to DNA profiling to the $3 billion Human Genome Project to individual genome sequencing for less than $1,000, less than a flight from New York to Singapore. Today, we've brought the price down to $600 a genome. Our next goal is to take the cost down to $100 a genome. So primarily by bringing down the cost of sequencing, these technologies are being adopted more and more and changing the clinical healthcare industry, okay? They also impact the agricultural industry by in, in plant breeding, um, maybe cattle breeding, cattle breeding programs, shrimp, shrimp farming, aquaculture, right? Veterinary sciences for sure, biopharma. And of course, they, it continues to play a very important role in the traditional discovery biology space. Just in the last few years, new sequencing and data technologies have meant that suddenly diagnostics, pharmaceuticals, and research are transforming radically with a projected growth of $24.2 billion. That's billion with a B, impacting lives across the globe. And it could just be recent events. Coronavirus. Coronavirus. There are fears a rapidly spreading virus. But that seems important. The importance of genomics is it's predictive of pathologies. Three and a half trillion dollar a year economic impact of chronic illness. About 3.1 trillion of that can be completely wiped out because of our understanding of biology now. So now it's, and that's really coming out of genomics. What all can we do? Edit out a disease-causing gene? CRISPR does just that. By sequencing the genome of an individual, we can find out their deepest, darkest secrets. Which is to say, find out exactly what's wrong and create a personalized cure. Think bespoke healthcare. Cancer. Identify the tumor's genome and you can have the right treatment. COVID. Sequence how it's infecting people and you can make a vaccine. We aren't treating people anymore, we're curing them. When I look at the future of genomics, I am looking at personalized medicines, medicines that are customized to my genome. I am looking at a possible cure for cancer. Take drug development. Genomics provides blueprints in place of blind research. Effective and cost-effective treatment made to order. Reducing waste for investors, increasing values, and driving down drug prices. Democratization at its best. And imagine a world without sick children. Genetic strategies like non-invasive prenatal screening means we can diagnose and treat at the earliest of stages. And there's another unexpected partner in genomics. I want to help you. With zettabytes of genome data, cloud storage will be the only solution. Combine that with advanced AI analysis and we save hundreds of lab hours every week. With AI, we could build collective intelligence we can, instead of having one AI somewhere that's looking at some finite set of data sources, we could take that and put out a thousand of them, have them teaching each other and leverage computing resources on a scale that hasn't really been done before. A symbiotic relationship between genetics and AI. The science fiction staples of the last century, now a reality. Expected that by 2025, the total amount of biological data will be the equivalent to the total of YouTube, Twitter, and the entire field of astronomy combined. Genomics is going to impact you as an individual, as a family, as a community, as an ethnicity, as a country, and of course, as a globe. It means waking up to a world without pandemics or even epidemics, or possibly even the common cold. 
which boils down to an industry that's suddenly funded through the roof and targeted towards everyone. Genomics is where social media was two decades ago. Every company, from big pharma to small tech, is looking for their market, their competition, and their new customers. We're looking at a nearly 50% return value on investments into genomics. The biggest upside surprises are going to come from the genomic space. Uh, and that's because the convergence of DNA sequencing, uh, artificial intelligence, and gene therapies, importantly, CRISPR gene editing, are going to cure disease. We're talking about everyone. Parents worried about genetic disorders, being treated for cancer or a rare disease, feeding a nation, saving a rainforest, ending a pandemic. We can do all that. Many countries globally are pouring millions of dollars on genome projects for varied reasons. Some are studying COVID-19 spread, some are studying personalized medicine, some are making reference databases of genomes. Also, slowly D2C is becoming a reality owing to declining costs of genome sequencing. Terabytes of data is being generated through all these activities. Now, riding on all these trends, a potential of $25 billion is unearthed in genomic space and an equal opportunity in adjacent markets like high performance computing, data analysis, and storage management, and of course, how can I forget artificial intelligence? So, what is genomics? Genomics is the technology of the future, the technology of a better future. Genomics is multi-billion dollar industry on the verge of unprecedented growth, driven by the amazing diversity that human biology presents. It's a convergence of many exponentials that makes anything possible. And the, uh, the notion of being able to completely wipe off most diseases that we know, completely wipe them off the planet is within our reach now just a better world for everyone. What it is, is a game changer, just around the corner. To keep tabs on what's around the corner, subscribe below to get notified about new episodes.